And it's that challenge of what am I truly worthy of and what can I do to cultivate that worthiness? Because yeah. being is the highest state of, of life, right? Like that's the greatest place to be. However, being is like sitting like this. I can sit like this forever. Eventually, I'm not going to have what I need because I'm simply being. The, yeah. the cool part about being a responsible creator is a responsible creator creates something, goes into it, experiences it, learns from it, and then comes back to center, observes what they learned, applies what they learned, and then goes back into the world and learns something new. You see, that's how we become successful. We step out, we make a mistake if we need to make a mistake. We learn from that mistake. We come back into center. We don't get triggered. We don't blame. We don't shame. We come back to center. We figure out what it is. We apply what we learned. We come back out into the world. And slowly but surely, we become successful. Yeah. By doing yeah. this, every time that we come into the center and then move into action, we become more worthy of a greater world. And that's just how it works. Yeah. So I would like to just caution everyone, especially as we move forward, no matter what you have done in your life, don't think that you deserve anything that you don't have. If you have something, you can say, oh, I deserve to have a roof over my head because I have it right now. And that's okay. But change deserve to have a roof over your head to I am worthy of having a roof over my head. Change that word in your mind, because if you can change that word in your mind, the world will reflect it very fast. Because where we're moving to is you have to be worth something to receive it. It doesn't matter what you believe you're entitled to. The age of entitlement is over. We're now moving into the age of authenticity, which means if I truly am worthy of something, I will have that that I am worthy of. And if I don't have it, spend the time to figure out why I don't have it. Dedicate yourself to being worthy of something you want. Learn through it, grow, experience, but most of all, Go out into the world and actually do things to learn and to grow. Don't just sit in spiritual escapism. And that's the challenge that we're all going to be facing up until yeah. February.